Uh, assemble your phantom for a CT scan. You need your three and a half centimeter blank plug that goes in this side of the phantom. You might use the set of four CT marker cylinders. These cylinders each have a linear array of five metal beads. And these just need to be inserted in the same orientation as indicated by the uh, red circles. Okay? You need a uh, target volume insert. This is the MRI isocentric volume insert uh, that has uh, three cavities filled with mineral oil and um, this is called the MRI volume insert, but I find it's also useful for the CT. And this goes in this side of the phantom. Okay. And now we assemble the two halves, the two hemispheres, which are held together with two large nylon Allen screws, which can be tightened with the provide an Allen wrench. Now, once you have your Lucy Phantom assembled for the scan, then you need to attach it to the head frame. And here I've got a brain lab head frame and a Lucy Brain Lab interface, and, and there are other interfaces available depending upon which kind of head frame you use. These, this particular interface slips on the Brain, uh, brain Lab head frame like this. And it clicks into place there. And then it's held in place at the top with these two provided screws. Then you have the Brain Lab clamp and spacer. It goes like this and uh, the Brain Lab neck it goes like this. There's a little mark here that you can use to set your angulation. And now at this point you have to decide what orientation you want your volume insert to be. If you want to be in a transverse plane, a sagittal plane, or a coronal plane, then you orient it accordingly on the uh, interface. So let's say we want it to be in a transverse plane, then we need to attach it to this point. So we'll take out these three plugs. This tool is provided that hooks into a little hole in these plugs so that you can pull them out. They're just friction tight. Now, the three pins here fit into those three holes and the center pin is threaded. And tighten down. You can adjust the angle right there. I want that to be at zero. And tighten down. Now I still have two some holes that need to be plugged here.
those nylon plugs are beveled to fit the contour of the uh, surface of the, of the sphere. Sometimes the plugs fall out. Okay. So now the Phantom is attached to your head frame and it can be attached to your localizer box with the fiducial rods that are used for your CT scan. And aligned in the Phantom for, for your CT scan with your localizer box. Then you can uh, import that scan into your treatment planning system and fuse it with your MRI scan uh, and do your contours on your MRI scan and you're ready to plan your treatment.